She has no idea what we're bringing up tonight. It's uh, it's around about autumn. So I've got some autumnal snacks with us. It's September 5th. Hey, it wasn't 85% or higher humidity today. Is it? It was amazing. Is it all pumpkin stuff? No. It's apple stuff. We're going to start off easy with some apple straws, cinnamon. You're familiar with veggie straws, right? Mm -hmm. The veggie straws, well, these yeah, are apple great. straws. And uh, we've got 30% less fat than your typical chip. You know, what makes our snack so irresistible anyway? Haven't you been wanting to know? Well, the combination of pureed apples and 30% less fat than the leading potato chips provides for a better for you snack. It's the perfect pairing of apples sprinkled with ground cinnamon. Some say it tastes like an apple pie. Others say it tastes like a baked apple. What do you think? Well, we'll find out soon. Our straws are not quite a chip, crisp, or snack stick. With these airy, crunchy straw snacks, you'll ever never want to stop snacking. And with this guiltless snack, you won't have to. That's why we call ourselves Sensible Portions. 38 straws per serving. 38 of these bad boys. Let's get snacking. A little bit of cinnamon apple action in there. Baked apple, apple pie, you decide. All right, so I'm assuming they're gonna feel different texture than the veggie. They are like just perfectly round little straws. <laughs> they remind me of cinnamon twists from, yes. from Taco Bell. Like that level of like cinnamon flavor. And like uh, fried donuts. Right, with a little bit of apple on there, right? Not what I was expecting at all. If I were a kid, I'd like want to drink milk through these. Not Water would not taste good with that. These are great. Healthy snack too. A lot healthier, but you're still getting like, it's very like a, I don't know, it's probably whatever. Yeah, sunflower, the oil that we got in it, it's still very satisfying. Only three sugar, three grams of sugar. And about 38 straws per serving, which means you only get four servings per bag, per bag but yeah, that's pretty good, y'all. It also says it's non-GMO and it's kosher. No Vegan. artificial flavors or preservatives. Gluten-free. Cool. Wow. Okay, that's a win. Does it only get worse from here? That's, uh, yeah, though it gets worse from here for sure. That's two thumbs up, which mm -hmm. does not happen all that often. That's close to the balsamic red wine vinegar. I wouldn't know because you ate them all. Sorry, not sorry. So, okay. Kettle brand potato chips. Apple cider vinegar flavored. <clears throat> Speaking of, okay, I'm here for this. You know? I love apple cider vinegar. It's a great, like, um, preventative remedy for, mm -hmm. like, all things sinus infection, I promise. Like, I feel like every time I've had a sinus infection, have, like, two tablespoons in the morning and at night, mix a little, like, ginger ale or something, just throw it back. It's, it's hot water. Yeah. Lemon, honey. You do the whole, you do the whole, like, thing with, like, the spices and stuff. It. They smell like vinegar chips. So really, I guess if I frame it like that, I'll be okay. I love kettle brand chips, right? I'm a little nervous about these. Oh. You love, she's the one that loves apple cider vinegar, and it definitely... The same for me, dog. They're not crunchy, like I want them to be, first of all, which makes them, gives them the feeling like they're soaked in apple cider vinegar, which is like, it's got that slightly like stinky feet flavor to it, like gym socks. I put that on a Birdie Bots bean, and you can sell it as a, as a, a stinky socks flavored jelly bean. I mean, it's, they are. They're very apple cider vinegar. They also flavor, but like malt and vinegar. But I love malt much vinegar. Better. Yeah. I know. Would be a much better alternative. 
Okay. So it did get worse. <laughs> it's gonna get better. I think. Um, not apples or autumn, but fun. Now, it has recently come to my attention this that I pronounced funny. this word wrong. These are Funyun flavored wavy lays. Can I say that I've. Who said you, you needed rings to have fun? For. Wavy lays plus Funyuns equals. Years. Get the flavor of Funyuns rings. I didn't realize now that on you Lay's said wavy Funyuns. potato chips. Try all three for limited times. Now hold up. Did you know they have Cheetos flavored chips? I didn't know that. I have not found the Doritos Cool Ranch flavored Lay's either. But oh my goodness, Cheetos flavored chips. So what are they supposed to. Funyuns. Funyuns. Like an onion. Funyun. That's too easy and it's, it's, it's reductive. No, it's really literal. It's too literal. It's it's reductive. Smells like a potato chip. Just regular Funyun flavor? Uh, no, regular Funyun chip flavor. <laughs> Funyun. <laughs> oh, that's so weird. They're salty. Onion y. That's weird because it's totally the flavor of Funyuns. I disagree. It tastes more like Funyun to me. I feel like I'm dipping a chip into some really, 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 really oniony onion dip, though. If you can't get enough onion flavor in your life, this is. I'm putting this back actually. I just don't need that much. It's a lot. Now, I will say half of the fun of a fun yun is the corn mealy, whatever, corn starchy, textury, crunchity, crispity. You know, if it gets like is one it of your like congealed. corn protein? No, it's not. These aren't in there. Well, I'm saying it. I think I still like Funyuns better because of the texture of the Funyun. It's got some of the flavor of the Funyun for sure, but I need I need the texture. Funyun. I don't say it that way though. I say Funyun. I say it faster. You're like Funyun. Are you, are you Moira? We need a Funyun. Yeah, no. That's exactly how you say it. <laughs> you know why. This is hilarious. Last one. Total left turn, kind of a bonus. Uh, Pride Pack Skittles. Are these the ones you got like in February? I don't want to talk about it. The date, the best buy date is August 12th, 2022. It says Skittles gives us a rainbow in support of the one that matters during Pride. So we in the Graham Stecker household fully support uh, Pride Month and Pride and Rights and yeah. So, um, I believe these are just black and like grayscale, black and white grayscale Skittles. And if so, that's really cool. And I, all the same color. Did I, did I, can I? Yeah. Yo, dude, it's like. Oh, weird. It's like, we're not in Kansas anymore. Can I show this with that? Yeah, it's like, it's like a black and white movie in that bag. Whoa, I'm in color? I'm in black and white. Hey, look guys, we're a Wizard of Oz. <laughs> I don't think we're in Kansas anymore. Look, we're back in we're back in Topeka, and we're we're out. Yep. Here, let's have a flavor taste test. Look, they're just they're just they're just grayscale Skittles. The but gray like, weirds me out. Like food should not be gray. I feel like most food probably is gray. Hmm. Is it? Well, it's still clear in the middle or white in the middle too. It's an interesting study in like how your brain perceives certain colors and flavors, right? Like, oh, here's just a random blank. So the lightest one they had is definitely orange. And the darker one was green apple. I also have a very light one. It was orange. This 
This is wild. Yeah, it really does. I like that. That was a red one. That was kind of funny, actually. It's interesting because you don't realize how much you rely on looking at the color right. to reinforce the flavor. For and when sure. it's not there, mm, there's my strawberry. Another orange? I haven't had a green apple yet. So I don't know if the colors really have to do with it. The darkest one was the green apple for me. Interesting. So there may be something to the... Well, this one is light with speckles on it. Do you think that's on purpose? I don't know. Or if that's like a, a food coloring dye thing. What's that was favorite? orange. There's a lot of mouth. There's a lot of mouth sounds. There's a lot of mouth sounds. What's your favorite Skittles flavor? Standard pack? Yeah. Yeah, the spec ones are orange. Um, that's a hard question. I guess I'll be boring and say red. It's a strawberry. But I guess like the purple one hits different too. Like it's a very specific flavor. Like purple Skittle is very much purple Skittle to where like the red Skittle is, uh, you know. Mm -hmm. Shout to Lime back in the day. Lime. Wow, I forgot about that. I also like the lime one. Limit does not exist, you know. But I think on the whole, like I, I'm a, I think I like regular Starburst, like those four flavors a lot. Mm -hmm. But I'm very into weird flavored Skittles. I think Skittles have really great flavors, especially combinations. Starburst, I can't really get into all the different flavors. But. But I also couldn't name like the exact flavor or color from whatever pack. I just am always down to try random Skittles because I like crave the sugar. Berry. Tropical, the weird combinations, the mm -hmm. spicy Skittles. That's the second one I've dropped. I haven't found the other one yet. It's under the couch somewhere. We'll find it. Fia will find it. Conversations about floor food. So yeah, I don't oh. think you can get them anymore. But definitely interesting. And I don't know if other like companies will do this, but really interesting to see what happens to your brain when you don't have that. It'll be an interesting study. I'm sure studies are done on it a million times, but. Or if you're colorblind. Mm -hmm. Well, you never know then. So your frame of reference really isn't the same, but. Um, those sticks are awesome. Give me those apple sticks again real quick. Like these, these are a great snack. Number Healthy, one, snacky. Sure. I would say get these right away. If you got kids, you got whatever, like. I think there's something. If about... you crave Taco Bell cinnamon twists, and yes, these are that's this is it. The oils that they have to use to like fry these sometimes can be upset your stomach, but. I guess we'll find out. It's already like nine o'clock at night. Better take my tongues before bed. I'm a fan of the Funyun chips. You're really just finding this out. Mm -hmm. I guess on what, what occasion have we had to say Funyun this many times in a concentrated amount of time? Road trips, maybe, but... Funyuns. No, it's like reductive. I'm a, I'm a, I'm gonna eat some Funyuns. Onion, 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 onion. Onions, Funyuns. Onions, Funyuns, Funyuns, Funyuns. Well, there's a U there. There's clearly... No, no, no. I'm gonna go back to it. There's clearly a U. Fun... Yun, it's the same flavor. F U N Y U N. Fun rhymes with yun. Fun yun. Fun yin would suggest O F F O N I O N. You know what it's F O N I O N. Onion. And this Fun. is why you don't work in marketing. I'm going to take my fun yuns and go home. <laughs>